Well, we're not here to talk nonsense to Bob blah, blah. We need to find out if the government has a good case against us. I mean, there is a lot of proof that my father was building houses in Iraq. Well, your father claims he was put up to it by a British syndicate. And you've been threatened, isn't that correct? It was. How would you like someone going after some stupid person in your family? Now, back off, you pons! It's been a week. Nothing's happened. Yeah, but you're not the one stuck under house arrest like a sitting duck. Oh, yeah, that's my father. That, that's why we had the meeting here, so that he couldn't interfere. Interfere? I had to pull down your pants and spank your ass raw. I'm sorry, have we met? Oh, yes, this is Larry Middleman. He's your father's surrogate. Surrogate? That's right, you dumb I hired this guy to wear a camera in his hat so he could be my eyes and ears while I'm stuck in this penthouse. This camera helps me keep tabs on you idiots while this thing rubs my ankle raw. I mean, look at this thing. I can't even go in the hallway without hearing that beep, beep, beep. That's one of my partners. Excuse me. You're not the only one who's got a date later. You've got a date? Her name's Rita. She teaches children at a private school, and we're just having lunch. Oh, lunch? Well, better bring some dog food, because all the girls you date are dogs, and dogs love dog food, right, Pop? Shut up, you idiot. I'm trying to watch the game. Just trying to make you laugh, Dad. That's all I ever wanted. Ryan Smith, the catcher. They're going to try to get their hands on any evidence they can to hurt the family. So you're saying shred the evidence? No, that's illegal. The prosecution is entitled to that evidence. Without it, they don't have a case. So you're saying shred the evidence? That's a felony. And I certainly couldn't endorse anything like that. Gotcha. Wink. Wink. Did you say wink, or did you wink? He said that too, Dad. We'll talk soon, folks. Thank you. Where are you going? Where is the circuit going? Stay there. I want to see what he's going to say. Don't leave. See you, Pop. We're burning the witch. Joe, you can't shred this evidence. You'll end up in jail. Dad told me to. How can I say no to that face? Get this stuff out of here and put it somewhere where, where Dad can't get to it. Are you in on this too? No, I'm just here to go out to lunch with your father. And said he's never felt more free in his life. I'm like a bird up there. Oh. Just then. Wow, look at him go, tied to that deck chair. It's so simple. My ankle monitor only goes off when I go out the front door. We need balloons. A party. We need to throw a party for Buster's stupid thing. Larry, go get some balloons. And Michael found a way to get Rita to his house after all. Hi, sorry, sir. I totally forgot about this meeting. What's going on? Your father's gotten a lot of bad press because of the escape attempts. Volunteer for something. I'll do anything to get out of this apartment. You'll do anything to get out of in this apartment. Oh, you're drunk. Yeah, Mom, can you just... And Dad... I... You know, why do we even need the surrogate? You know, Dad's in the Don't apartment. Don't come in here. Don't come in here. Don't come in here. I said not to come in. Check it out here, please. I'm watching the game. I said not to come in. I did not spend money on a surrogate, but you can just... I lost him. I think you've got your hands full trying to make this guy look good. Well, look who's finally gracing us with his presence. What's the surrogate doing here? We're meeting with a lawyer. So I've hired this guy to be my eyes and ears. You know, Dad, this guy costs us a fortune. He's worth every penny. Hey, I didn't say that. Well, we'll just have to be honest with these Japanese investors. They uh, come from a culture that values honor and respect. And Godzilla. Godzilla! Right. Okay, that's Godzilla! This, this needs to stop now. Okay, this is exactly what we shouldn't do when they show up. Mom, that's enough. What? We're out of vodka. Maybe that's it. Maybe we should do to the Japanese what they do in their movies. Build a miniature city, put it outside the window. Tell them it's far away. It'll look real if you squint. God knows they're squinters. What do you think, Dad? A whole tiny town. Another brilliant idea, Einstein. Really? You'd like to build it with me? Larry really never knows how to sell the sarcasm. It's a stupid idea. Uh, I'll build it with you, Job. What is that, a train set? Look down, Larry. No, not down at your feet. Left. My left, your right. What is the matter with this guy? And let me guess, he's probably saying all that too. It is a train set, those Japanese sights. I'm never gonna find my way past Pass that hallway sensor. Dad, what are you doing here? Is this the package you sent me? Tiny Town. This is for Tiny Town, isn't it? You did like my idea, didn't you, Dad? I think he's in the can. Actually, George Sr. was in the kitchen trying to soothe himself with an ice cream sandwich. 
Oh, cool, a train set. Oh, I've always wanted one of those. Maybe we could build our tiny town okay. together. Do you want to, Dad? Buster had always wanted to do the same with Joe. Goody, yeah, I do want to. Yay, I do want to, goody. <laughs> Joe was thrilled, as was Buster. <laughs> Only Larry was disappointed, but he was such a pro, you'd never know it. Job was bonding with the man he thought his father was controlling. Almost done with the water tower. Neato. His real father, however, had gotten lost within the walls. Where the hell am I? He was actually somewhere between the linen closet and the guest room. You know, I'm really glad that we're doing this together. I've never felt so oh, close to you. I feel the same way. <laughs> He's crying now. God, look at us. We're like a couple of girls on the last day of camp. <laughs> they destroyed our town, but they can't take away our memories. Oh, I've had the time of my life. I think he's being sarcastic, Job. No, I'm not, Mother. I mean, lover. I like making love to Mother. I mean, lover. Oh, my God, Buster, is that you? Yes. Job, it's just I wanted to spend some time with you. That's all. And you enjoyed it. You can't deny that. I guess you're right. Maybe we should spend more time together. Oh. I'd really like that. It's weird. It took some idiot parrot man with a camera in his hat to bring us together. But even a pro like Larry has a breaking point. Surprise! What's this? We're throwing you a wedding! <gasps> Oh, how lovely! A nurse! Everything you see, show them the waffle bar, Larry. It's over there. Check out Banner, Michael! I'm gonna go set up. Yeah, you know, I think that we should, um, wait a little while. Wait, why? I don't want to wait. I want to get married and have sexual relations like you promised! Uh, Where did you get this firecracker? I love her, Michael. So do I. I want to kiss my new daughter-in-law. Hey, not on our time, Larry. Right on the lips. No, no, Dad, please take it easy. Hey, Mom, what, what's going on? I thought that you guys were against all this. Well, we figured you know best. And who are we to interfere? And you love this girl. And the rest will just be little happy surprises along the way, like you said. Yeah, with the exception of the retard thing. Oh, God. Tell me you didn't just say that. You knew? You knew, and yet you still wanted me to go through with this. What can I say? I'm crazy about the little dullard. Oh, my God. She's rich. This is a new low, even for you, Mom. What is wrong with you? Larry, go to a mirror. You're fired. You're fired. What? It's over. And this is how you tell me in the middle of a wedding? You shouldn't have said anything. You shouldn't have said anything. So you were anything. right. Now what am I going to do? 